Hey y'all, welcome back for another video. If you're new here, my name's Mark and I typically talk about photography, camera gear, travel, and pretty much whatever else I feel like. But today I am opening up the Citus Link Bridge from Aperture. This is going to upgrade all of your old Aperture lights to be compatible with the Citus Link phone app. This just came out and it allows you to either continue using this old remote that you're all used to or uh, upgrade to the future of the Aperture ecosystem, which gives you control on the app for not just 120Ds, 120D Mark IIs, some of those old lights, but also that app controls all of these new lights that Aperture has come out with. So these light bulbs and the MC little RGB squares, the Nova series, pretty much everything that's gonna come out from here on out will have app control functionality. So I decided it was time to upgrade my lights. And uh, rather than replacing all of the fixture heads with something that could be controlled through an app, I was happy to see that Aperture came out with this little accessory and it's less than a hundred bucks. So let's get it set up. All right, so setting this thing up is uh, pretty simple. You gotta download the Citus Link app and register if you're a first time user. From there, the bridge is actually gonna show up as an available device in the app itself. And then you'll see the uh, different groups and different channels, just like you would with uh, the old remote system. Now you can control all the same functions that you could on uh, the remote. But in addition to that, you're now able to control all of the effect functionalities that are built into say the 120D Mark II that previously you would have to go in on the actual controller itself and try to dial that in and get it just right. Now you're able to do it from your phone so you, it's a lot easier to get that done. And at least in the you know quick test and playing with it that, that I did, that was the case for me. So this is gonna charge via USB-C and you can use your you know, MacBook charger. They do include a USB-A to USB-C charging dongle right in the box and these antenna, an, antennae, antenna, which, what's the plural of antenna? Is it antenna? Antennas? All right, this is a dumb joke. I'm gonna stop doing it. There's even a quarter 20 on here so you can uh, mount it easily. So even if you already have some newer aperture lights that you can already control with your app, this device is gonna give you extended range on all of those devices as well and only enhance the integrity of your like Bluetooth mesh system that you're setting up with all of these different lights. But overall metal construction, metal build quality, this thing feels really, really solid. It's not like you're gonna be walking around using this, but if you needed to film a scene where you're pretending to talk into a walkie talkie, um, this, this would definitely come in handy for that. Uh, other than being a really cool device that'll upgrade all of your old lights for uh, pretty cheap compared to spending 1200 bucks on a new one. So uh, I, I, I hope you go check this out. And if you do, use the link down below in the description so that you support me and this channel and leave a like or a comment down below. Yeah, all right. Well, thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.